everyone, and welcome once again to another edition of the Red Run and Williams Real Estate Show. I'm Shannon Deskins, along with Jennifer Brown Day, and I noticed you walked in the door today with your fingers crossed, and I figure that's because the groundhog did not see his shadow. That is correct. I'm hoping he's right this year, and then we do get an early spring. Which is good for the real estate business, because mm -hmm. the people that have gone through these snows and they've been pinned up in their house, they realize how small that house really is <laughs> and they get out and want to see new ha new homes. Absolutely. And you know, we always talk about doing drive-by visits and if it's warmer and nicer weather without a foot of snow on the ground, that is a whole lot easier for people to do. And I'll bet your phone rings more on those January and February, you know, Fridays and Saturdays when, hey, it hits 60 degrees and people want to see these houses. Absolutely. Absolutely. Yeah. The warmer weather definitely helps us out. All right, well, let's start out with the first one here in Pike County. Mm -hmm. This is one that we've talked about before, but mm -hmm. it's been reduced. Yes, so we wanted to make sure and mention it again. This is one we, I think we've actually talked about it a couple times, but this is a great house in a great location that we wanted to make sure kind of stayed on the top of everybody's list. And this one is one of those that is convenient as far as where it's located. Mm -hmm. It's on uh, Lower Johns Creek, which is near Joe's Creek. Correct. This is on, it actually kind of ends at um, Lower Johns Creek, where, mm -hmm. jo where Joe's Creek ends, right. right there at the park. This is on Pinson Branch, directly across from that park. And it sits kind of right at the mouth of the hollow, so it is a very convenient location, easy to get to. And the house is just spectacular. It's a three bedroom, two and a half bath. You've got 2,400 square feet of space above mm -hmm. grade, but this one also offers a full basement that's been partially finished. And, you know, as far as this area of Pike County on mm -hmm. Lower Johns Creek, it's different than what a lot of Pike, how the land lays in a lot of Pike County. You've got your bigger valleys. Mm -hmm. um, it's more of a country setting. But because there's so many different ways to access this area, it's convenient. It really is. You can get there multiple ways. And I think I was telling you, I was actually over that way yesterday and got to see an elk right down from this property. I mean, it's one of those areas that you can kind of drive through and see the wilderness and drive through and see the wildlife. Three bedrooms. Uh, two bathrooms. So this is a large home. It is. It's a large house and it has a lot of extras. They've done a lot of renovations, new bathrooms, new windows, a metal roof. Um, they even did a new septic system. Mm -hmm. So this is one hopefully you could move into, not have a whole lot of worries with it, and just have a great house uh, ready for your family. And I love because you've got that covered front porch. Mm -hmm. And this front porch, honestly, they've made it a, a room for the house. It's tiled. They've got ceiling fans. It's got privacy partitions. It is a whole other living room to the house. Well, you've made me want to look at this house, and I'm not even <laughs> looking for a house. So hopefully your phone's going to ring on this one. I hope so. And this is your listing, correct? This is my listing. They can call me in the Pikeville office for this one. That number is 606-437-2333. And when you do give Jennifer a call, mention 105759. That's that MLS number that is for that specific house. That's correct. Okay, moving along, we'll go just get on 23 and go north to Prestonsburg. Mm -hmm. We're going to go to Prestonsburg, and we're actually going to talk about a commercial listing. Uh, we're going to mix it up a little bit this time and do a little bit of commercial as well. But this is uh, an old bank location in Prestonsburg on South Lake Drive, which is kind of the main drag that goes through Prestonsburg. Mm -hmm. But this is a ready-to-move-in facility in a perfect location if you've got a commercial business looking in that area. And I noticed on our notes that we've got in all caps, and bold, highest traffic in Floyd County. Yes. The South Lake Drive is going to have your highest traffic flow mm -hmm. in Floyd County and specifically in Prestonsburg. So again, makes it a really, really good location. You know, and you hear when anybody's talking about our region right now, what you, the buzzword is diversification. Mm -hmm. The coal industry isn't doing well. They're bringing other industries in. Other other businesses are coming into our area. And this is, like you said, anything, and put your thinking caps on, because any business that would utilize a drive through would mm -hmm. be perfect here because you already have one. Absolutely. You've got the drive through set up. And like I said, this is, it's a totally up-to-date facility. It's got alarm systems. Um, because it was a bank, it obviously has a safe. This is on a corner lot, so you've got easy access in and out, plenty mm -hmm. of parking. So, yes, put on your thinking caps anything that could you utilize a drive-through, this is the perfect place. 
Okay, so a commercial listing mm -hmm. in Prestonsburg, right on the main drag, which is South Lake Drive in Prestonsburg. So if you're in that market, you're thinking about putting a new business in, or maybe your business is growing and you want to expand to a second location, Definitely. Who do they call on this one? This is one I would recommend calling our Paintsville office. They can okay. give any of our offices a call, but uh, I'll give out the Paintsville number for this one. All it's right. 606-789-8119. Okay. And the price on this one isn't bad either. Mm -mm. Uh, 339 So that's a residential price for a commercial piece of property. Exactly. Exactly. All right. So definitely give them a call on that one. So if we're going to move to our next location now, what we don't have to go very far. We Just don't get on the old road like you're going to go to Paintsville and turn right on Route 3. That's correct. This is right down 321, like you said, on Route 3, like you're going towards Martin County, but it's actually a Johnson County listing. And this one is convenient as well. So mm -hmm. if, if you're a family and someone works in Prestonsburg, someone works in Paintsville, this is a perfect location for that. Exactly. And even still, if somebody works in Martin County or anywhere over mm -hmm. that area, again, perfect location. And it's a beautiful home to look at, too. I love that we've included the picture of the rocking chairs on the front porch. Well, the front porch, to me, makes the pictures. <laughs> <laughs> it just looks so relaxing. But, yes, you've got a country front porch on the front that's covered so you can utilize it all year long if you want to mm -hmm. sit out and watch the snow sit out and watch the rain enjoy the warm weather whatever you'd want to do and it's a spacious home four mm -hmm. bedrooms three bath nearly 3,000 square feet so that's a huge home it is it's a huge house and the great thing about this one when you get up to that kind of square footage typically you're looking at you know a story and a half or something like that this is a ranch house so everything is very accessible depending on what your family mm -hmm. need wants or needs are this could kind of fit those needs you don't have the stairs very easy to maintain and access. And from the pictures that I'm looking at, it looks like a big open mm -hmm. layout too. And I know those are very popular. Yes, it is. It's an open layout. It's got a lot of uh, big rooms that are open to each other. So again, a very friendly, friendly lifestyle. You know, and I see that, that this is one of the newest subdivisions in Johnson County mm -hmm. also. So it's a new area. It's one of those hot spots, I guess you could say. It is. This has become a very popular neighborhood because of its convenience um, in that area. So this is one that you definitely want to keep your eyes peeled for. And if you're looking in that area, you know, it's always good to look up the Stony Brook subdivision because there are quite a few new listings and new houses going in. Okay. And the price on this one for everything we just said, $229,000. That's correct. That's very attractive. It is. It is. It's a good price for especially the size of the house. Right. Mm -hmm. All right. So this one is uh, your listing? This is actually out of our Paintsville office. Okay. This is Teresa Preston's listing, so they can give her a call. Um, I'll give out her cell phone number for that one, 606-205-7890. All right. And when you do give Teresa a call, mm -hmm. mention 106050. That is the MLS number for that particular listing. That's correct. Now, Jennifer, we're going to move to this next listing, and I mm -hmm. really like this listing because it has all the bells and whistles. Yes, and we are honestly going to struggle to get through all the amenities this house offers. So, so you know, we've already got you going, wow, what is it? Well, let me tell you, <laughs> it's in downtown Paintsville, mm -hmm. and that is... If anybody is familiar with the Paintsville area, these properties don't come open very often. They don't. We don't get um, houses, especially in this price range of this magnitude, that come open in downtown Paintsville very often. And when they do, they move off the market. So if you're looking, this is one to, to jump on immediately. And one of the things that I saw first was it has a three-car garage. Okay, mm -hmm. a lot of homes have that, but it's climate controlled. <laughs> so that lets me know that whoever built this house they like all the little extras. So that's exactly. a, a snippet to what the rest of the house is going to offer, I think. Exactly. If they take the time to do that in the garage, you can guarantee the house has, has all the bells and whistles. Absolutely. And, and it really does. I mean, first of all, four bedrooms, three and a half bathrooms. It's mm -hmm. a huge house. It is. But like you said, first floor master suite with mm -hmm. a fireplace. Yes, absolutely. And it's, it's got, you've got the first floor master, but then you also have an additional three other bedrooms. You have an additional two and a half other their bathroom so it's a total mm -hmm. of a four bedroom house um, and then in the master bath you have a tile shower with the body sprays uh -huh. you've got a custom kitchen that has the travertine uh, stone backsplash and granite countertops so it has all those extras throughout the house and you've got you know you're thinking downtown paintsville you're thinking well there's not a lot of space 
that's not the case with this one because mm -hmm. if you're looking at the pictures, there's this huge front yard that has been professionally landscaped. Mm -hmm. Professionally landscaped, very, very uh, attractive to kind of pull up to, a lot of curb appeal. And then in the backyard, I know that you'll also like this, it has an in-ground heated saltwater pool. You know, and I see you've got a formal dining room. I mean, you've even got a library. Mm -hmm. So, you know, if you like to do a reading or if you like that quiet time, I'm sure mm -hmm. there's tons of space in this home to be able to escape life in a, in a little corner of this new house. Absolutely, and it's they're going to um, sell it with the appliances, so you've got the stainless appliances are going to go with it. So, like we said, there's just so many extras and so many things on this one that should be attractive. If anybody's looking in this price range in that area, definitely one to consider. And like you said, this is not going to last long. No, no. All right. And the price range she's talking about is 695000 so mm -hmm. that sounds like a big number, but if you're in that market and you're already looking at other homes comparable to that price range, you're getting a lot for that price in this one. Absolutely. You really are. And again, with the location and all the extras that are coming with it, it's a great price for that house. Okay. Now, this is another listing for Teresa Preston out of the Paintsville office. Out of the Paintsville office. I'll go ahead and give that Paintsville office number. Okay. Is that okay? Yes. 606-789-8119. All right, and when you do call Teresa, 105901 is that MLS number, which will pull up that direct listing. That's right. Okay, now, this last one, I mean, we're, we're all over the board <laughs> with the show today, but I think that's good because this is so, it truly is something for everyone's show. Yes, and that's what we, we're hitting residential, we're hitting commercial, and this kind of counts as both. This is both, and <laughs> I think the biggest one on this one is, is income producing. Mm -hmm. You're going to make money with this property. Yes. Well, that's the idea. <laughs> in McGoffin County, actually in Salyersville. Yes, it's in Salyersville. This is off Mash Fork, so if anybody's looking in that area, they, they're they probably familiar with the Mash Fork area. Mm -hmm. But this one, again, has so many things that come with it. We'll struggle to go over them all, but you're talking 150 acres total. Right. That includes a 24-site trailer park that includes city water and city sewer, which is huge. City sewer on a trailer park in this area is a really big deal because that means you don't have to put in kind of a community sewer system. Uh -huh. So that is a huge selling point for this one. Um, you've got a main house, which is a brick house. Could be used as like an owner's home or something like that. Right. Completely renovated, just newly done. You also have two tenant homes that come with it. You've got one operating gas well that is income producing. Um, you have bottom land that's considered floodplain, but great for gardening or anything like that if you would want to use it. And then also included, it run the, this farm kind of hits the end of Fox Run Subdivision, which right. is a subdivision over in Sayersville. And this actually includes a couple lots in Fox Run Subdivision. So you're looking at lots in a subdivision, <laughs> a couple <laughs> rental homes, your new home, yes. and then the, the trailer park that has 24 sites. You know, and I'm not sure what someone would charge for these, but if you, you do your math on mm -hmm. what you know some places charge, right there you're thinking, this this is one property that could pay for itself in just a few short years. Likely, it's income producing. This is something that somebody can live on the property, have, make a living, make their income living there, and have money coming in. Like I said, a no-brainer because sometimes <laughs> we'll be able to show a listing that may have a guest house or mm -hmm. an apartment over the garage that you're like, well, that can pay part of your mortgage payment. This one is like a new job. Yeah, <laughs> we can hope. Yes. But uh, again, and then all of that, you said pay your mortgage payment. The total cost on this one is only three seventy-five for everything that we mentioned. So if you start breaking that down and looking at the numbers. This, it's like pretty, I said, pretty we're going to say one favor. more time, no brainer. <laughs> yeah, absolutely. Me. So, and, and whose listing is this one? Is this yours? or? This is out of the Paintsville okay. office, so they can just give the Paintsville office a call. I would be more than happy to help them with it if they also want me to. But, <laughs> but you can. That's absolutely. one of the things that we talk about so much about your company mm -hmm. and the real estate in this area is you guys can show anybody's listing. Absolutely. We can show anybody's listing out of any office, our office or another office mm -hmm. um, in Eastern Kentucky. So absolutely, they can call anybody and get help. But again, I would recommend calling the Paintsville office on this one just simply because they're going to have more of the information. You're so not selfish. <laughs>
Let's give that phone number so somebody can go ahead and, because okay. they're, they're standing there waiting on us to give this number. I hope so. 606-789-8119. 101-997 is this listing in Salyersville. So give the Paintsville office a call. They'll be glad to show you this property. Mm -hmm. All right, well, we've done well. We've given five listings, like we said, across the board from Pike County to Johnson County. Something for everyone today. Absolutely. And I guess we're going to leave them with your Real Estate Minute. Sounds good. Thank you. This week, our Real Estate Minute focuses on property management. Red Brown & Williams is the number one property management firm in Eastern Kentucky. And we have agents ready to assist landlords with renting spaces or tenants looking for rental space. Are you a commercial business looking for space currently? If so, we may have just the space for you. We have spots available in the Town Center building in Prestonsburg and Mayo Plaza in Paintsville. Are you looking for a qualified agent to assist you with property management of commercial or residential property? Give Red Brown and Williams a call to assist you with finding great tenants. Thank you for watching the Red Brown and Williams Real Estate Show. We hope you will join us again very soon.